Hello, everyone. I wish you all have a great uh, Friday morning. I'm Christina Barthanidou, investment analyst, looking at what's happening in the U.S. versus the Canadian dollar in the daily chart. Uh, well, the market has experienced one of its most explosive uh, rallies in a while, jumping by 2% uh, yesterday and straight up to 1.3222. Uh, that is a 20-month high, and uh, that is also where the 1.3230 resistance that we discussed in previous videos is. Uh, well, the price, of course, couldn't hold around this high, retracing uh, some of its gains to close around 1.3116. But uh, what is striking about this impressive advance is that the price has finally uh, closed above the 1.3077 and 1.3026 uh, region, which uh, had been a blocking upside move since uh, mid-May. If we switch to the weekly chart, uh, we can see here that the uh, pair is now ready to close to close comfortably above the 200 weekly moving average for the first time since uh, since November 2020. Uh, therefore, uh, that is a bright sign that uh, the progress could continue in the market and uh, the technical picture in the daily time frame is uh, can, is also supporting uh, that ex such expectations. Uh, first, uh, the price is well above its uh, upward sloping moving averages and uh, has made a new higher high. Uh, then. Uh, if we look at the momentum indicators, the RSI has also surpassed its previous highs and it's uh, still below its uh, 70 overbought level. Uh, likewise, the stochastics is uh, set for rebound, but uh, it's also below 80, uh, while uh, the, uh, the MACD is uh, now strengthening its positive momentum above its red signal line. Uh, therefore, uh, the bias is clearly on the bullish side at the moment, and what remains to be seen is whether the price will uh, will close above 1.3120 to bring uh, the 1.3222 uh, and 1.3230 resistance zone back under the spotlight. Uh, if the rally successfully overcomes that obstacle too, uh, then the next target could be the 1.3340 and 1.3380 region taken from the second half of 2020, uh, the 50% Fibonacci tracement of the uh, 2020 and, one, and 2021 downtrend is adding extra importance uh, to this region. Now, in the event uh, the bullish signals prove false and the price are versus lower instead, uh, that would be very that wouldn't be very concerning if the 1.3077 and 1.3026 uh, comes come to defend uh, the bulls. Uh, the ascending trend, the ascending uh, trend line drawn from 1.2516 could also uh, could also keep optimism in the market. However, if that cracks and the price slips below the 20-day moving average and the 1.2956 and 1.2936 support region, uh, then I expect the decline to continue towards the 50-day moving average at 1.2860. So finally, uh, making a conclusion, uh, well, I expect uh, upside pressures to persist in dollar loony, especially if the uh, price closes above 1.3120. Uh, nevertheless, even if it uh, if the pair corrects lower, I would still uh, remain uh, positive in the market until I see a clear violation of this ascending trend line over here. So that's all for uh, dollar loony today. Thank you for watching. Have a great uh, weekend.